Hey, what's up, y'all? Michael J. Howe. Some people call me uh, Magic Mike. But, uh, no, uh, I know. Shame on me for playing on my phone again while I'm driving. I'm on my way over to uh, Lake Odessa job site. Uh, Got to protect the ears, you know. The sun is brutal on a ginger like me. But uh, I just want to speak some things that's on my mind. You know, when I drive, I uh, have a tendency to... Uh, think a lot you know as long as my hands are busy my mind is free and uh, I think that's why it's part of my skill sets and my talents that allow me to be the musician guy that I am so uh, please know that uh, you know I do this these types of things responsibly when it's safe to it's not like I'm out here in the middle of traffic and start stop go traffic trying to you know do things but I just need to show this to you guys because I've been driving this drive quite often and just mesmerized by the beauty of nature see as a child I got a computer quite young you know when I was about 13 14 years old and uh, I've always loved nature and technology it's people that I don't trust <clears throat> so with that being said uh, I'm just kind of speaking out to a lot of the lost and hopeless and broken and uh, miserable people out there in the world. Uh, first of all, God is real. And Jesus Christ can be a very good method and way to get into the kingdom of heaven. But for me, I think love is, is all you really need. And uh, as long as it's genuine, true from your heart, love, you'll be all right. But we're going into some crazy times. I'm not looking forward to being debited automatically from your bank account for traffic violations or the day where it's illegal to drive a gasoline car. You know, what I could really use is one of them electric cars that has autopilot so I can do my work while I'm driving. You see what I'm saying? But I'm just going to turn my camera around real quick so you can just see some of the beauty of these farmlands and nature and what people are doing. It's amazing. This section of road is just gorgeous for me. I'm heading towards Lake Odessa about by Freeport. We got a little bit of a tractor and a semi here. You always got to be cautious when you're going by cross traffic. M50, there you go. So what I kind of want to say is we're in some unprecedented times of technology and uh, there's going to be a lot of craziness going on in the world and what you need to do is remember the past you need to seek out old information old scriptures and, and don't think that one book is better than another if it's truth and it's honesty and it's love it will set you free you know it's never too late as long as you're still breathing to start aiming up start trying to do better and look for the love and the God in your own special unique way you got to listen to your soul we all have different faculties that we barely even know about we've got our intellect and our imagination and our memory and we've got our our body and our mind and our spirit and our soul spirits come in many many different forms and functions and they can enter your body in so many different ways you got you got to defend yourself against that and sometimes the armor of God is what you need for protection now I, I seek out a lot of different information I seek out all kinds of yogi mystic self-help gurus I seek out Jewish rabbis I seek out people like sad guru and Simon Jacobson rabbi I think I seek out people like Tony Robbins and Bob Proctor, and just there's all kinds of information out there, but you gotta go for it, and you gotta listen to it, and you gotta digest it, and you gotta do what's right for you. You gotta figure out what what is right for you, and you can you can always aim up, just like that spiral effect of going downwards towards the grave, and how things get worse and worse and worse and worse and exponentially grow. Well, things can also get better and 
and better and better and they can exponentially grow upwards too. But you have to make that choice. You have to do the work. You have to find the information. It's all in your head. It's all in your mindset. And stop showing so much hatred towards other people and other ideas and other methods and other love because it's all around us. I mean, I've been to China. I've been to Jamaica. I've been to France. I've been to Germany. I've been to England, the United Kingdom, and I've, I've seen love and, and happiness everywhere I've gone. And I've also seen pain and suffering. So what I'm trying to say is stop waiting for death to get to heaven or hell because it's just a mindset. It's how you live right here, right now. Hell can be right here on earth and so can heaven. And, and I hate to say it, but I'm living proof of this. I mean, I love to say it. I don't hate to say it. I love to say it. I am living proof of this. You can you can chase your dreams. You can take care of yourself. And, and you come in this world by yourself and you leave this world by yourself, no matter what. And it's the love and the stuff that you do while you're here that matters. So just keep aiming up. Keep digging. It's possible for everybody. So we got some construction, so I got to go now. But uh, we'll talk to you later. Magic Mike. The real Mike Howe. Out. Oh.